Let's go from Access Report to Excel to HTML5 with D3 JavaScript to R and back. Here we'll run the R code to send and receive the WebSocket. We could do this later, but we'll run it now. We'll run a simple performance report that's out on box.net per hstsp.rep. We'll run it annually from 1990 to 2011. Choose this graph option, which allows us to interface with our macro and see the data set Excel sheet. This is a stripped down version of Bruce McPherson's C data set that does many things, but um, in this case converts to JSON. Choose OK in these cases. Access calculates the annual performance, then sends it to Excel. Excel converts it to JSON, embeds it into an HTML web page, and this is the output. A nice bar chart using D3 JavaScript that Mike Bostock has generously provided. Um, and we stopped here in the last post, but now let's take it a step farther. We'll send the JSON from Axis to R now, and R will come back with a nice binary performance summary chart image uh, that it sends. So we replaced the D3 with this. Anybody familiar with performance analytics package will be uh, will notice this immediately, but just in case, uh, you'll see it zoomed in here. So the web page, when you push the button, let's do it one more time. We'll take the embedded JSON, send it to R. R will convert it to an XTS and then run performance summary chart on that and send it back as a JPEG.